Hi, I'm Daniel with Plumpy Thimble, and today we are headed to the circus, and having never been to the circus myself, I can only assume that it's something like this. Now, I base that not only on a preconceived notion that's been populated out of nowhere in my head, but I also take it from the game we're looking at today, which is Topito, a game where players compete to stack things up at the circus within different rings and try to get the perfect picture taken just so that they can score enough points to win the game. Let's take a look at how this works and what I thought of it. In Topito, players have a hand of cards that give them certain criteria for the elements of the game. There are wooden blocks picturing various elements of circus performances, as well as three circus rings that act as bases. On their turn, players may pick up a single piece and place it on an empty circus ring, or on top of an already existing pile of pieces. Or, they may pick up any portion of a stack, holding on to only one piece, and move it to another ring or another stack of components. If any of the stacks meet the criteria pictured on a player's hand of cards, they yell, Photo Time! Reveal their card, and place it in front of them. However, if a player causes pieces to topple off of a stack, they must return one of their completed cards to the deck. The first player to complete seven cards is the winner. Topito is absolutely a children's game, which is important to know about going into the review. It's going to lack a good amount of depth, and the stacking element is pretty straightforward in terms of a lot of other dexterity games. Turns can be a bit boring as you're just taking one simple action. Also, I'm not particularly a fan of the fact that this game may be prone to ties due to the way that pictures can be taken out of turn. Though I do like that it keeps players involved even when it isn't their turn. I really do like the look and feel of this game. The artwork and components are all top-notch, playing perfectly into the theme of the game. And I love that players are essentially put in the place of spectators hoping to get that perfect picture to commemorate their time at the circus. And while it is a little light, I love the mixture of thinky puzzle married with the risk and reward. You may be able to score two points this turn, but can you safely move four animals to a new podium without them falling? The ultimate decisions you make may be a little flat, but executing those decisions is a whole new dimension. And while these types of hybrid games can be difficult to pull off, especially in a children's game, Topito manages to do it splendidly. The whole game comes together in a nice, complete package that's fun to look at, play, and interact with. Stepping away from the circus and looking at the game in a critical light, there's things to complain about in this game, but not many. The toy factor is high, so it's going to be instantly appealing, and stacking dexterity mixed with the art direction is engrossing enough to draw attention to it. Add in strategic stacking, and this certainly is a game that I can recommend to families, and those just looking for a lighter game to fill out an evening.